today we are in southwestern Brazil on the border with Argentina. Here we are visiting one of the seven natural wonders of the world. For this experience we are staying at the Belmont Hotel, the only hotel within the national park and the only hotel with a view of this amazing natural wonder. Yes, here we are. As you've seen it from the footage, it's the Iguazu Falls, you've probably guessed it. And we are at the Belmont Hotel das Cataratas, so the Belmont Hotel of the Waterfalls. We are specifically in the Brazilian side of the Iguazu Falls National Park, because the Argentinian side on the other side of the river is still closed. Spending a night here is way over our budget, but we still decided to indulge this time. But that means that the next two weeks we will only be eating noodle soup to make up the money that we lost here. But then again, seeing this view. It's not really a loss, is it? That's a once in a lifetime experience. Now we freshen up a little bit because in less than two hours we have a meeting upstairs in the tower with a nice view of the sunset and the waterfalls. So, see you on the top. guys as you see we are actually not in the tower because things didn't go as planned like the whole time in our around the world trip but it's still a beautiful view a view that not many people get especially if you want to see the waterfalls after 5 p.m you have to be a guest of the hotel because people from outside are not allowed to be here Hi guys, so here we are in the garden of the hotel. As you can see, there are some strange trees where orchids grow on the trees. So it's very, it's crazy. And behind us, there's a restaurant where we ate breakfast and also dinner last night. There's the pool and here they have a tennis court. How do you call it? And look at this monstera leaf, guys. It's amazing! Double as big as our Monstera at home. But it's time to bring you a little bit closer to the waterfall. Well, for us to go a little bit closer to the waterfall and show you how it looks from closer up. The waterfalls actually span a length of 2.7 kilometers on the Argentinian side, on the other side of the river and on the Brazilian side over here. Yeah, but it's not all waterfall of course, but I think that 1.7 kilometers of the 2.7 kilometers are waterfall. Guys, I think, I think that we've seen a lot of water so far, right? All those little waterfalls around us. But then, then it turns out, boom! That's actually the big one. It's insane how much water. And right now, they are actually in a drought. There's not much water usually. There's like 10 times as much water going down on average than it is at the moment. And still, even though it's a drought, so much water. That's insane. Beautiful. So we are here before other people, you know, because the park is still closed. But we spent the night in the hotel, so we were allowed to come here before the people. And as you see, it's just Evelyn, me and the guide and the beautiful waterfalls. And you know what? When the waterfalls were created one and a half million years ago, they were 23 kilometers further down. Now they are up here and they are growing back one to two centimeters each year. But this is just awesome, beautiful one of the seven wonders of the world.
Sure. It was two waterfalls from far away, but now let's get a little bit closer. So when I said we would get closer to the waterfall, that's what I meant to be on a boat and we'll get wet. We have seen the waterfalls from up close from land. We have seen them from the boat, got wet, and now we will see them from up top. So that was it, my promise experience from the top. So I saw the waterfalls from almost all possible sides, from land, from water, well, from below the waterfall and from the air. I haven't seen them from the Argentinian side. Well, not really. I saw them from the Argentinian side, from the helicopter, which is landing right behind me. But anyways, and now it's getting too loud. So I don't know if you can hear me. This has been it from our experience here in Iguazu. It was really wonderful. I can recommend anyone to come here. It's like the most beautiful waterfalls in the whole world. And as always, thank you very much for watching and don't forget to comment, like and subscribe. And see you again in the next video. Bye bye.